today on Wander. Morning sunrise. Good morning. <laughs> so I'm here in Fort Stockton, Texas. And check it out. Paisano Pete, it's right behind us. Welcome to Fort Welcome to Fort Stockton. Hey guys, good morning. Ah, beautiful Texas morning. Check it out. We're here at this rest stop. It's on I-10. No pets allowed. And there's a map of Texas. Here we are right here, traveling along. This is where we're going. It's cool in the mornings, but if you want to see what true Texas is about, you gotta get away from the interstate. And you gotta go to the back. Of course, be careful where you go. You don't wanna go somewhere where it's scary. You come out to see this. Good morning! <laughs> so I'm traveling today on a journey. We're heading to uh, the great old Fort Stockton, Texas, and Dominic's coming. Here he is. He's, enjoy he's joining me. Um, that Asian lady. <laughs> did, he, did he go to the wrong bathroom? No, the men's restroom is closed. Oh. So they say use the women's restroom. Really? Mm -hmm. Gotta walk in there, I guess. Just knock. Knock before you enter. So I came around the corner, she's like, oh my goodness. Oh, she was wondering why you were in there? Yes. <laughs> and I... Eight thousand. 
2,200 people that live here in Fort Stockton. Mm -hmm. It's quite a few. I don't know. Yeah, it might be more because that was in 2010. So maybe y'all have grown since then, huh? Yeah. And uh, we also see here y'all are known for Comanche Springs. Mm -hmm. Right oh. now it's flowing. Oh, can we pass by and see that? Yeah. Okay. And uh, I hear y'all are very well known for uh, this giant bird. Yes, Paisano Peaks. He's our, the largest road runner in the world. In the world? Mm -hmm. Oh, I want to see this thing. And uh, let's see. Let's check out when Fort Stockton was first created. Apparently Fort Stockton was made, it was, it said Fort Lancaster, they sent an infantry out here to take post along the Comanche Springs on April 12th, 1859, that was a long time, and it was named Camp Fort Stockton in 1860.
in them willows. So we're gonna go see Paisano Pete. And this will be exciting. Okay. You ready to see Paisano Pete? Ready. Ah, this is the, this is the biggest road runner in, in, te in the world, right? Not just Texas, just the world. Stockton, Texas, and check it out. Paisano Pete, it's right behind us. Welcome to Fort. Welcome to Fort Stockton. excited that we got to come here to Fort Stockton and we hope to come here more often check out these beautiful locations historic locations if anything so as you can see here here's the entrance of downtown right here behind me it's really cool interesting huh well that's it for Fort Stockton Texas thanks for joining us today I'm so excited to get to share with you Fort Stockton, Texas, and we're going to go see what else we can find. I heard they have the best sweet tea next door. Yes, Should we go to get some? Yeah. All right. Yes, Why are we going to go there? Because they have the best sweet tea at 5 o'clock somewhere. Because it's 5 o'clock somewhere, right? That's right. Let's do this. Ah, we saw this here and we're like, this is cool. Oh, they can't get around. Well, our friends are about to join us now. So let's go see them and then we'll go to 5 o'clock somewhere. Come on, it's the road. All right, let's go. And they tore it down. And um, it had been there for quite a while, but the building was falling apart. And they, uh, they ripped it down. And they're going around town and they're finding other buildings that are pretty old and are... Oh, that's right. They tore down the old The hotel, uh, hotel. is gone. Mm -hmm. And a building across the street from it that was also brick like the hotel. Mm -hmm. A wide variety of... What would they call this? A, a beer drive? Uh, a beer barn. Beer barn. It's a beer barn. Look at this. You get a beer around. You were in a car and we were just looking at the beer. Mm -hmm. This is how you do it in Texas. So and up there at the top it says, Thank you for your business. It says Fort Stockton, Texas. Oh, it sure does. You guys know how to do it well. You know how to offer good refreshments. It's a neat sign. Yeah, look at Dr. Pepper. Mm-hmm. Yes, it is, certainly. Where 
So we're here right now at this, I guess you can call it a Confederate Memorial. And uh, as you know, we like to do here on this channel is we like to check for uh, Espiritus. So I'm checking here right now. I've got my ghost radar on. Well, let's check it out. Check it out while I'm checking my ghost radar. So Fort Stockton was known back in the day for a lot of Confederate soldiers that came here. And this is one of the cemeteries here. What's interesting is they saved time on some of these unmarked graves. And they cut out the crosses. And then they also, uh, as you can tell, uh, it was basically a twofer. So you either got a negative cross or a positive cross. Let's hope that's a good sign for whatever you were. said wild and just a second ago it said okay. map over here at the cemetery all right he's nothing doing, else he's doing a report i don't know johnny oh they need to fix their sign all right, they old court it. cemetery see there's some hanging on the tree yeah that's a deal really you know what they are for probably mm. for the birds they probably put bird food in them I think they are for the birds, yeah. They probably have birds here. Sight. What do we see right over here, this big old okay. thing? This is the old um, railroad depot. Really? And this is where all of the, the trains used to stop and they would uh, restock right there. Yeah, Bicycle. Oh, that's where? I don't know if the spirits are speaking. <laughs> This is your Zero Stone Park, you'll call this right? This is Zero Stone Park. And then here is Quickly. other selling uh, nativity sets. Oh, that's interesting. This is St. Joseph Catholic Church, or as they like to say, the downtown campus. Oh, okay. Because they have officially uh, made St. Joseph, St. Agnes both together now, even though they always were. But they call that the South Side Campus and or North Side Campus, and this is the Downtown Campus. Oh. This is Annie Riggs Museum. Oh, old hotel. It's an old hotel, and it was also a hospital for soldiers. Wow. from the fort. This is the Grey Meal Salon, Saloon, and it's very nice inside. Oh, you've been inside? Oh, very nice. Um, and it's very nice. It's an old saloon, and it's always been a saloon. Is this is mirrors? downtown. This is downtown. Do you need those murals again? Oh, you're good, you're good. Okay, and it's mostly owned by Terrazas. Ooh, furniture terraces. Um, they have their furniture over here. And I guess yeah. Ooh, a lot of fancy stuff. There was a building there. That used to be the building that was in between there was a movie theater. And mommy says she used to come there as a little girl. And it burned to the ground. Oh wow. This is Machinitas. Oh, is that like Ocean a party house? Game room. It's a casino. Oh, I'd love to see the creek. Oh yes, let me go show you. So in a minute on our right hand side is gonna be the fort. Oh, all the 
oldest civilizations, old histories right in the middle of it. There it is back there, all of that. The blue-green buildings are churches and an old um, house that belonged belong to the, I guess it would be like the general. Mm, those people stole their Christmas decorations. <laughs> oh yeah, I see now. Yes, here's the fort. And I'm going to go over the bridge and you're going to get to see down below the oh, creek nice. and then we'll walk over to it. This was, yes, this was the old hospital. Mommy said that they would come there for their vaccinations and stuff when they were little girls. And um, now it's closed down. Field here is it used for anything? No, but last year um, we got a lot of rain, and it was actually up to here the water. Oh, this was full of water. Yes, and all of these trees they had the water marking almost like three feet up. Oh wow! And all of this filled with water. And we put up posts of them on Facebook. What if they come throw us in the water? <laughs> Are there Here's where I took my picture with my family. Oh, really? Uh -huh. Are there gators? Yes. Mm -hmm. Wow, it's moving. Yeah. We should get in. No wonder those kids are getting in. Oh, nice. I wonder those kids are getting in. There's some moss. Ew, that's what's doing when they got out. Yeah. That's not moss. No, I'm just <laughs> oh, do y'all come out here for walks? Yes, we do. We haven't been lately because it's been so cold. Really? But, uh, it's been nice. It sure is. That's nice to have a walk back. Oh, we're on top of the water. Look at that. Look at that. Mm -hmm. But it goes all through there. Oh, it's scary over there. And then it goes over to where Flying J is. Oh, I'm way on that side. Uh, loves. Wow. It goes all the way to where Loves is. It doesn't smell swampy. I guess because mm -hmm. it's moving. And then it's spring, spring water. Or... So we could drink it? Yes, yeah, it's like the, the one that you don't get the drinking water, but you get the spring water. Well, in that case, let me look at the bottles. <laughs> Oh, this is a fun day in Fort Stockton. Mm -hmm. Oh, I enjoyed my trip here in Fort Stockton with my buddy too. <laughs> Fort Stockton local. 
Mm. So thank you for coming along and giving us some expert advice where to go. Oh, you're welcome. There's Meh. more to see, so Ooh. I'll show you around next time you're down. Mm -hmm. There's some other sites to look at. Now time to get in the water. Huh? <laughs> no. All right then. We'll see you very soon. <laughs> now we'll uh, we'll sign off and uh, happy trails. Oh, happy trails. Yes. All right. So uh, how are we gonna sign off today? Should we do our saying? Yeah. All right. Let's do it. You, you can, can wander, wander far, but just don't, don't forget, forget who you are. are. Yes.